What's up guys, Risky Tech here, and welcome back to another tech review. I make tech reviews weekly, and if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to get notified every time I drop a new video. In this video, we're going to be checking out the best Ultrabook ever. The 2016-2017 Razorblade Stealth is a super lightweight and portable Ultrabook. This laptop comes with an i7 7th gen processor, 16 gigs of RAM, a 512 gigabyte SSD, integrated Intel graphics, and a 13 inch QHD touchscreen. Also included is an anti-ghosting chroma keyboard, which means that the keyboard can process multiple keystrokes with precision and it has Razer RGB lighting. And you know how much I love RGB. Now on the side, you will see the charging port, which is a Thunderbolt 3 port, and a USB 3.0 right next to that. On the other side is an HDMI port and another USB 3.0 port. This laptop offers an eight hour battery life, plus the weight of the laptop is only 2.8 pounds, which makes this a super light Ultrabook. Now I say Ultrabook because this laptop isn't really meant for gaming compared to Razer's other laptops and products. It can run games like CSGO or Dota if you have it on low to medium settings, but if you try to play Doom or Witcher, then you'll definitely get frame drops. If you do want to play games with this very portable laptop, then I recommend getting the Razer Core, which is an external GPU, which makes it so you can run those higher end games. My only downside to this laptop is that most of the parts are not upgradable or customizable. The 16 gigabytes of RAM is soldered onto the board, but the storage is upgradable because it is a PCIe SSD. Other than that, the Razer Blade Stealth is highly recommended for people looking to get a super lightweight laptop that can do anything except for writing high-end games. If you are interested in this laptop, a link will be down in the description. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, then drop a like. And if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.